get it. Francesca may have kept you up last night because of that thunder snow. And good day, Wisconsin Weekend Meteorologist Doug Higgins joins us now with more on this rare event. Hi, Doug. Hi there, Pete. Yeah, I was another one of those people who were trying to get a little bit of sleep before I had to go into work extra early because of the snow. And we had thunder snow last night. And we've got some great images to show you. Let's roll the video right now and kind of listen on it. What we've got. Saw that as well. Thunder snow. Now, people oftentimes ask me, boy, I've never heard of thunder snow before. This never happens in northeastern Wisconsin. Actually, it happens a couple times a winter, usually one or two times a winter, but it's kind of a unique phenomenon. Let's go back to our map right here. This was at oh, 1.50 in the morning, and our lightning tracker had lightning all the way from Rhinelander through Door County and into uh, Menominee and uh, Marinette even down in Milwaukee, but that was more in the way of a, a mix of rain and snow. So what makes thunder snow? That's the big question on a lot of people's minds. Well, this is what happened. It's, it's a similar situation, although not exactly uh, like the thunder that we normally see and the lightning that we normally see in the summertime. What happens is we had a very, very warm air mass, not quite above freezing, a little bit below freezing, but warmer than the air that surrounds it. And it rushed up from the south, and we're talking rushed up very quickly. It was going at over 50 miles per hour, and it caused just a lot of uplift. And we have all that uplift. Well, that creates the good old thunder snow. And I just want people to be aware, yes, it is a little bit hazardous out there. I got my workout at 2.30 in the morning, Rachel. I shoveled my driveway. It was so heavy and so wet. I was soaking wet by the time I got done. I've got a picture of me on Facebook. I kind of look like a drowned rat. Oh. <laughs> well, you won't be alone today, that's for sure. Thanks, Doug. You